this episode, we're going to bake something really crazy. It's called salmon green onion cupcakes. I know everybody's raising their eyebrows right now and thinks you must have been crazy. No, <laughs> it is really, really good. I've tried it a couple times and I'm telling you, you're gonna love this recipe too. Because when you eat the cupcakes, it's just so soft inside, so savory, full of flavors and um, a little bit of sweetness, saltness, and then a little bit of kick of the green onions inside. You're gonna love it. Let me show you the, the ingredient first, and then we can get started. I have here some all-purpose flour. I've put already some garlic powder, salt, baking powder, and some pepper. Of course, you need some salmon. I've cut the salmon into very small pieces. It's about like um, a quarter inch size. I have some green onions here that I cut very small. Two eggs. I got some oil here. Creme fraiche. Bavarian sweet master, Dijon mustard, horse radish, some honey. I've preheated my oven into 180 degrees Celsius. Into my mixer bowl, I'm going to put the eggs also at room temperature. I'm going to beat the eggs until pale, about two to three minutes. So, three minutes later, can I put some oil inside? The creme fraiche. Or if you don't have creme fraiche, you can also use sour cream or maybe yogurt. All the dry ingredients. And mix them for about one to two minutes. This is the consistency that you want and you're gonna put your salmon inside. Mix a little bit. Just use a spatula because you don't want to break the salmon pieces into very small pieces or cut, cut them off. Just, I think with a spatula is enough. The green onions. If you don't like green onions, maybe you can use dill. I prefer green onions over dill. I don't know. I think dill has really strong flavor. I mean, in some dishes with fish, I really like it. But in my cupcakes version, I think I will skip the dill. And instead of that, I use green onions. All the mustard inside, horseradish and And the honey. Oh, that looks beautiful. Over here, I have a muffin tin that I've lined with the liners. And um, I just, just going to use a spoon put all inside so I'm gonna put these into the oven for about 25 to 30 minutes or until the salmon is really cooked otherwise you're going to have sushi cupcakes done later my cupcakes were in the oven for exactly 30 minutes just insert with a toothpick comes out clean when it's cooked. I try also pick into the salmon. It's also cooked through. You're gonna cool them down first before you put the frosting on top. This is how they look like. After I cool them down a little bit, it took about 10, oh, sorry. A 
I cooled them down a little bit, took about 10 to 15 minutes. Two are gone already, they're missing. <laughs> um, my son ate them. They're really delicious and he loves them. Now I'm going to show you what I'm going to put for the frosting. Some heavy cream here, it's about a cup. Cream cheese. Cranberry jam. Some salt. And some green onions. Put the heavy cream inside. Beat for about three minutes. Three minutes later, I'm gonna put a little bit of salt, just a little teeny tiny of salt, not too much. And put the cream cheese inside. Mix them. So these are mixed well and I'm going to transfer this consistency into my um, Ziploc bag. These are savory cupcakes. It's very creamy, a lot of flavors inside. So. First thing what I'm going to do, I'm going to put some cranberry jam, just a little bit on top of my cupcakes. Just like this. After that, I'm gonna put some cream cheese. So. Now you can put some green onions on top. A little bit of cranberry jam on top. You should keep these in a fridge for about 15 to 30 minutes and you can serve them. So now the fun part, I'm going to try one of these. I just cut it half. I really want you to look at it. Look at that. So moist. Fluffy and yummy. Mm. Mm. Oh my god, it's really good. 
the cranberry jam is a little bit sweet. The cream cheese is slightly salty because you just put a little bit of salt. The salmon, you don't really smell, it tastes like salmon. I'm telling you, it's so good. Um, the muffin, it's, um, it's very soft. Mm, it is so delicious. I think it's just about the combination between sweet cupcakes and um, what is that? Mm. This sounds really crazy, salmon green onion cupcakes, but it's not crazy at all. It tastes so good. For the complete measurement, go to makemakekitchen.com or for other recipes as well. I have a lot of recipes. I hope you enjoyed spending time with me and see you next episode. Bye!